Paradise Island for one, prison for another. Lesbos has been the center of the European refugee crisis for years. Moria refugee camp was intended for 2,000 people, but when I was there, there were 8,000. Now there are 19,000 and counting. Everyone is afraid of fire or violence every night. The refugees wait three hours per meal every single day for food. Street cats and street dogs refuse to eat. Some go to secret food drop-off points where NGOs hand out food in forests because public donations to refugees result in violence or imprisonment by fascists or police. Others swim in the cold sea to go fishing, even in wintertime. Just imagine living in one of these tents of 10 square meter with 10 others. Some were fed up with these inhumane living conditions and chose to live in the mountains. It is like being in prison without knowing how long your sentence is. What you see here is a fraction of all life jackets of all refugees crossing the Sea of Turkey. The rest has been burned by the government to remove evidence of this black page of European history. Thirty to forty thousand people didn't make it because they sail with toy dinghies at night, crammed with fifty to seventy people paying over 1000 euro to try their luck. Just because the United States and Europe made a huge mess of the Middle East and we destroyed their homes. Fascista. Big, big problem. 